Hi guys, welcome back to another video. Um, and it's going to be a PlayStation Blind video. Um, I think this is update number 9, I think. I think I got it to 8 before I just sort of abandoned it. Um, so yeah, I've got 5. Five PS1 games to show you guys, but all parts of the PlayStation plan, um, and all but I'd say all but one of these, um, I wasn't gonna bother picking them up for you know for for whatever reason. Um, so yeah, uh, but if if memory serves correct, I've got these these five like I said to show you, and I think there's only one more, maybe two, one or one one or two more. Um, and then the rest, the others, which, you know, I'm, I'm not going to get due to either cost or the fact that I'll, I'll never play them. So, yeah, these videos are always nice and short, so let's crack on. Uh, first one I showed in the last video, which hell knows if it's been uploaded yet or not. Um, it's really causing me a headache. <clears throat> um, it's, you know, it's even worse the fact that I had the, such a massive break. Didn't have to worry about uploading and all the rest of it. And yeah, the, the last video I've done, if it's up, uh, that's great. And if not, I, I don't know. Um, but that, that game anyway uh, was Pocket Fighter. I just figured I'd show it again. Or for the first time. I don't know. <laughs> uh, yeah, the next one is another one of the ones which I wasn't going to get. Um, even though it's a, it's a great game, lots of great memories with it. Um, I do actually have it on Xbox Live Arcade, so I, th I, I wasn't going to bother, but it was really, really cheap, um, so I did. And that is Super Puzzle Fighter 2 Turbo, a uh, great little puzzle game, I'm sure we all know it, we all know what Puzzle Fighter is. Um, but yeah, ton of great memories playing this, um, and I actually, you know... If I do say so myself, I, I think I got pretty good at it. Um, so that's that. Uh, it's in mint condition. All these are in mint condition, by the way, guys. They're all fully complete. Um, as you know, I, I don't get PS1 games that, don't, that aren't complete. Um, all the boxes are, are nice too, so that's great. Anyway, next one. Um, that's another one I wasn't going to bother picking up because, let's be honest, it's a little bit ropey. Uh, there was a lot of... Uh, Excitement, I suppose, when this first came out. Um, I think it got okay-ish reviews in magazines. Um, but it was kind of funny because I remember me and my, my friends at the time were discussing various things in games and, you know, what, what'd be cool. I, we mentioned um, this, and then a couple of years later, it actually gets made. Um, but anyway, it is Star Wars, the Masters of Terascassi, or just Masters of Terascassi. Which obviously is a uh, 3D beat em up similar to Tekken or Tashinden or, or whatever. But yeah, I mean, it's not a very good game. I remember being a little disappointed with it, to be honest. Um, yeah. But it was really, really cheap. I forget the price. Ugh. I'm not too sure. But yeah. So I thought I'd get it. Uh, next one. Which is the last of these which I wasn't going to bother picking up. Uh, which may shock a few people. But this is... Uh, uh, let's just show it first. Let's just show it first. It is Final Fantasy VIII. Um, yeah. I remember when I first got Final Fantasy VII. Um, the very first JRPG I'd ever played in my life. Um, and for whatever reason I wanted to get it. <clears throat> um, and I did. And I've loved it ever since. Favourite game of all time. Um, and then, what a year, a year slightly more than, slightly more than a year after that, uh, the trailer for this one got released, and oh my god, it looked awesome. Um, so then, by the time the game got released, I, I got it. Um, so I'm pretty sure after I finished Final Fantasy VII for like the second time. I, uh, I was looking for other JRPGs just to, you know, just to see. But none of them really sort of caught my interest. Um, so then that came out. Um, and to be honest, I didn't really gel with it all that much. Um, I got about a quarter, halfway through the game. 
Uh, and I just stopped playing. I, I just didn't. I don't know. So yeah, I wasn't going to get that back. Uh, which I think I mentioned a long time ago. In another video. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I had some store credit at a at a, an, in, an indie store. Independent video game store. Uh, they didn't really have a whole lot in stock. Um, but I noticed they had that. Which was actually quite cheap. So I, I, I got it. Anyway. Last one. Uh, really happy to, get, to finally get this again. Um, it's not hard to get. I mean, it's, a, it's a pretty common game. But every single time I came across one. Uh, there's always something wrong. Um, and I was going to just cave and get the platinum version. Because um, I've seen it for sale online for around about £5, which is fair enough. Um, but yeah, then I, I got this. It is the big box version. Bigger box version of the almighty legendary Doom. Yeah, this was one which I wanted to get back. Um, you got to have a bit of Doom. Because uh, this was the first time I'd actually ever played this game. Never played it on PC prior to this. Um... So yeah, finally got it, big box Doom, fully complete, uh, and yeah. So that's uh, that's it, Let's show you uh, again if you can read that. So that's another five, like I said I think there's two, maybe three others, uh, and then the rest I'm not going to bother with, uh, which I'll get, I'll, you know, I'll get into that in the, in the last part of the, the PlayStation plan, which will be episode nine, nope. This is 9, it'd be 10. So yeah, I'll, I'll do one more update for the PlayStation plan um, with the final few games. And I'll just go through all the ones which I've, I've gotten over the last year or so. If that actually, might even be a year. Um, okay guys, that's it. PlayStation plan over. Um, I have gotten a, a bunch more PS1 games, some really cool ones. Um, I was thinking about sticking it on the end of this video. Um... But, no, I've not been doing that with the, any of the other PlayStation Plan update videos, so... I'll do a separate pickup video for the uh, other PS1 stuff. It's really, really great games. Um, I'm not sure if there's going to be any more I need to wait for. I'm not sure. Um, so, yeah. As always, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, let me know what you think. And, yeah, I'll see you all soon. Take it easy.